Tapas is the first UAV in the country to get certified by Center for Military Airworthiness, Simulac. So far, six airframes have been realized and 25 flight trials have been carried out using a 3 to a 5 at ATR, Chitradurga. Tapas has achieved maximum endurance of 85 minutes, an altitude of 14,200 feet and range of 40 kilometers during the trials. Tapas has been designed with large endurance parameter, minimum drag and lower fuel-consuming turbocharged IC engine to achieve higher endurance and higher ceiling. In 2017, first firing of indigenous of UAV engine was carried out, it is now almost in the process of reaching highest altitude range as well as endurance. Full performance test was also carried out on first and second prototype of the engine, one engine handed over to aid for ground testing after completion of 50 hours of endurance testing. VRDE, Armed Nagar, is coordinating the indigenous development of power plant by MSJM Automotive, Coimbatore. New 180 horsepower diesel turboprop engine is designed for use in both push and pull configurations and is likely to be used on other programs also. The aerodynamic characteristics and performance was verified in wind tunnel tests prior to the successful flight testing of UAV. Abinitio airframe developed for the Tapas uses predominantly high performance composite materials. A new high lift airfoil ADLC2 has been designed with high endurance parameter with high aspect ratio and optimum taper ratio to reduce the induced drag. With an endurance of 24 hours it will be capable to carry different combinations of payloads like medium range electro-optic, MREO, long range electro-optic, LREO, synthetic aperture radar, SAR, electronic intelligence, ELINT, communication intelligence, COMINT, and situational awareness payloads, SAP, to perform missions during day and night. The indigenous development of payloads is in mature stage. The development of SAR payload is in advanced stage with one prototype undergoing flight trials and evaluation in Dornier manned aircraft. The Cummint payload is also in advanced stage. The MRO development is in advanced stage with prototype fitted in Tapas, a 5, and flight tested and is undergoing flight trials with aircraft Umbra. Ground control station has capability to receive data slash status and control payloads on the UAV. Remote video terminal, RVT, provides users at various levels to view the displays and images from onboard payload sensors. Defense Electronics Application Laboratory of DRDO has developed the data link for the UAV. Data link having range of 250 kilometers. Simultaneous operation of short-range loss and long-range loss, HD video downlink and more than 40 km RVT range. Flight test with loss data link have successfully completed at ATR. A consortium of Hal and Bell is involved in the development of TAPAS from the design stage. The teams are actively participating and concurrent TOT is taking place. The consortium will be the lead integrators for the production, after getting the subsystems. The program is expanding the envelope of the flight trials and increasing the range, altitude and endurance in the second half of this year in which all the payloads, imported as well indigenous, will be flight tested. AF5 to AF8 will be used to carry out user evaluation trials. Indian Armed Forces need 100-150 male UFs. Altitude ceiling should be around 30,000 feet or above. Endurance should be more than 24 hours, with SER and EO slash I dot R. Payloads. The maximum range should be more than 250 km in loss mode and the max possible with SATCOM link. 30 plus male are required to have capability of engagement of static and mobile ground targets and maritime targets, surface and underwater, with a min standoff dist of 20 km. DRDO with help of production partners Hal and Bell will deliver the drone to the Indian Armed Forces by 2020. Once TAPAS is fully ready for operation, it will reduce the import of expensive precision attack drones.